Hello everybody, my name is Ash. Hi, I'm Cece. And I'm Mowgli. <laughs> and, <laughs> and welcome back, back to our channel. channel. <laughs> so, for everyone who doesn't know, this is my cat Mowgli. <laughs> He, he's over it now. He, he, oh. Oh, no, he's the star. Yeah, he's the star. <laughs> he's like, everyone, watch me groom. So today we're going to do a bit of a mukbang. We got a lot of different Japanese foods here, a lot of snacks, as well as we picked up sushi on our way home. So we're really going to dig into that because we're starving. Yeah, we are so hungry. And we just filmed going to Oto's, which is a Japanese market in Sac. So if you haven't seen that video, we'll link it down below. Go watch it. But that's where we got most of these goodies. And so we're going to eat our sushi and try some of these out with you guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, friends. Well, let's get into it and dig on in. Yes, I'm ready to eat. So we got our sushi from Makuni's. I got, I think it's their veggie... What is it? It was like a veggie deluxe box? Or? Yeah, we got these like combo lunch deals. Combo, yeah. Yeah, so mine has three rolls. I think one was called Fair Oaks, one Midtown, and one called, I think, Zigzag or something. I don't really remember, and I don't know which is which. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um. So this, I forgot what it's called, but it is a cucumber avocado roll. Mm. There just simple and good and the other one is a vegetin roll with veggie tempura avocado and I think a few other things I don't remember there's like green onion on here it looks really good that does look really good first bite mm -hmm. that's really good yeah we've been waiting to eat yeah I don't think and did you eat breakfast mm -mm. I did not eat breakfast either all we had was um coffee Oh, you know what's a perfect time? Because I was just thinking, man, I'm a little bit thirsty. We got some ramune. Mm -hmm. um, they are both um, lychee flavored. And they got Kakashi Sensei from Naruto on them. Yeah. Really cute. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cute. I've been drinking these ever since I was a kid. My mom and I used to always go to World Market. And we'd mm. literally just go for these. And I like literally the honest soda they really are i'm the same way i've been drinking these since i was a kid they're just so much fun but what's so funny is in my family like all my cousins were like they it was like their mission to get the little ball out mm -hmm. for some reason and so finally my younger cousin his mom she smashed it <laughs> <laughs> and we got the ball out for him. <laughs> That's dedication. <laughs> yeah. So um, these ramen sodas, they're these like carbonated, like sugary drinks. But what's fun about them is that they come with these little like ca green caps. And as you can see, you have to kind of like rip them out of these little holders. And then what the, you do is there's a little marble right here. And you're like the fun part is that you get to pop the marble and it like makes it fizz. It's a great time and you guys are gonna get to see this. But the scary thing is, is I don't know for you, but I always say a little prayer because there's been a few times that mine pops and it just explodes. Oh, yeah. So I'm always like, please don't, don't explode. Yeah. Okay. Three, okay. two, two one. one. Yes. Yay! <laughs> Let's try. Mm. Pretty good. It's nice. Yeah, I, I, I like it. It's not like I dislike it. It's just like... It's very, like, artificial, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the strawberry is my favorite. Strawberry is yeah, good. Yeah, strawberry and melon. Those two, Yeah. they know how to go. I like regular, too. Plain is yeah. good, too. Yeah. It's always good to stick to the originals. Mm-hmm. I'm going to eat some more sushi. Me too. <laughs> well, he's got a toy now. Mm hmm. Really hard to try to talk. Oh my god, you brought it back up here? Moogles! <laughs> Are you a dog? <laughs> you can fetch! <laughs> okay, so we. Took a little break literally just to eat because we were so hungry. Yeah, so hungry. So we literally barely talked and we just scarfed down our sushi. Mm hmm. But now we're back and we are so ready to try our snacks. 
So yes. we've got here some, these are Calvi pizza potato chips. We've got some salted egg lays. And then we've got these wheat crackers that are seaweed flavor. Some, um, car oh my God, caramucho <laughs> potato sticks. <laughs> <laughs> They're spicy and tasty. Hot chili. We got a big bag of this. These are some hot chili potato chips. Those are really bomb. These are the Haichu sweet and sours. I've never had Haichu before. So we've got a couple of Pocky options. Um, I will not lift these because, you know, Mowgli's in charge here. So we got mm -hmm. some matcha Pocky some chocolate banana. Uh, these are an off brand of Pocky, but kind of the same thing. Mm -hmm. And uh, these are cookies and cream, so like Oreos. Uh, we got a chunky strawberry, not just strawberry, the chunky strawberry. <laughs> yeah. And we've also got chocolate coconut. Mm. And then we have, these are the Jaga Choco. They're just called Jaga Choco, but they are like, potato chips with chocolate on them. And then we got the milk bomb kuchen, bomb kuchen? I don't know, milk bread. Yeah. And then, oh, you can explain these because these are yours. Yeah. I bought curry. We're not going to be trying this, but we wanted yeah. to show you what we got. Yeah, because these actually require legitimate cooking. Um, so yeah, these are um, Kakumaro um, curries. I got a hot flavor and a medium hot. And then we got these, so these, I don't even know, they're, so basically, oh, they're Paco Choco, yeah, they're chocolatey lollipops, and then we got, what was this again, the, it's, it's like a sweet. sesame rice cake? Yeah, sweet rice sesame cake, and then this is, I got a few of these, we're not going to be eating this, but this is miso ramen, and I absolutely love miso ramen. It is so good. And then we got the strawberry mochi, which has the strawberry, like, jelly stuff in the middle. And personally, the strawberry is my favorite. They always, it tastes so good. So we also got the boba drinks, which we don't have here. We've decided since we have so much stuff, we'll put that in another video where we show you guys how we make the boba and how it tastes. So let's dive in. Uh, where do you want to start? Do you want to start more with like sweets or do you want to start more with like chips? Um, maybe we should start with the chips and kind of, you know, you usually eat dinner before dessert. That's true. I'm a traditionalist, I guess. Okay, she's gonna close her eyes, guys. We'll do it this way. Okay. This. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited for these. Pizza potato chips. Okay, so let's try these. I don't know uh, if you guys can see that at all or if it'll focus, but there is a little bit of cheese. Like, mm -hmm. they smell good. They got ridges. Yeah. Let's give them a Mmm. That yeah. is good. Yeah, they're very, like, um, they're definitely, they taste fresh. Oh, yeah. Like, no problem with the crunch. Like, it was a very nice crunch. It didn't taste stale. I don't know why I expected it to. I think because of the cheese on top, I was expecting it to be more like bite. Mm hmm But I like that it's not so much bite because it's less work on my jaw. Yeah. They're so good. Okay, so I guess let's rate on a scale of 1 to 10. Love it. I give these a 10. I'm going to give it a 9. Because oh, yeah. I want to see if there's anything better. This is the very first. Well, I would probably give a lot of things a 10 because I love chips in general. You do. So, all the chips might be a 10. We'll see. Okay. I'll be nice and I give it a 10. <laughs> that was a bomb. Where should I put these? Um, probably should I? I don't even know if I have a bunch of clips like that. Um, oh, let me try something really quick. I used to be able to do it. I don't know if I can now. I forgot how it works. Oh, oh no. Okay, I remember now. I think... It's like you roll this or you roll something and then you tuck it under. 
I know the fucking water in there. I watched it before. Does that need tape? Oh yeah, I do have tape. But we can go like that. Oh yeah, yeah, that works. Okay. Okay. Next thing, should I close my eyes and you, you shuffle them with okay? it? Yes. Good. Were you counting the high chews? No. Okay. I have to I choose a like, sweet. And I probably moved the pizza ones kind of out of the way so I can't touch them. Yeah. Okay, are they good? Yep. <laughs> oh, <there it> is. <laughs> <laughs> we got the salted eggs. Yeah. <laughs> I'm curious to see how this smells. Oh my god, I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> It's not bad, but it's not like, mmm. I can't, it's savory. Yeah. That's the only, like, I can't, I can't tell you what it is. Oh. I can taste the egg right away. Mm. It's kind of like an omelet. I don't like those. Like, they're not bad. I'm just not a big eggs fan. I don't, I don't like, like the food. aftertaste. Mm-mm. I'm not going in for a second. <laughs> It tastes very yolky. Mm-hmm. That's funny you said that because I was just thinking that because I was trying to be like, what does it taste like? Like, I can taste the salt and, like, the egg, but it is. It's very yolky. If you like eggs, then maybe you'll like that, but... You have not. to really like eggs. Yeah. Like, I, I like eggs, but... Not like that. Not like that. Let's oh. switch to these. And I've had these, too. I forgot to tell you guys that. So these are actually supposed to be like the texture of ramen noodles. So these are the seaweed flavor. I don't know if we said that. They look like this and it looks like little crushed up ramen. I don't know if you like seaweed. They're okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we forgot to rate these. Oh, I give those a fucking zero. One. Oh. <laughs> for the, for the, Hardcore egg enthusiasts. So these, even though I've tried these, like, I do like them, but I have to be in the mood for these. They're not something that I can just, like, eat all the time. So I give these, like... They're okay. They're very, like... They taste like a health cracker. It is more like cracker than yeah. chip. I wish it had more salt in it. Because I like sweet. Yeah, because I like seaweed, but I like, like, salty kind of seaweed. Yeah. Not really, like, with it with sweet, so I actually give them, like, a four. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of them. Okay, you want to do those? Yeah, let's do these, the little potato sticks. I'm excited for these. I've had something similar, but it wasn't by this brand, and it wasn't spicy. So they come in oh, these little, sweet. like, little baby straws. <laughs> no, Mowgli. He's like, I want to try one. I'm gonna put all these in my Yeah, mouth. I'm like, I'm gonna take a bunch. I like them. I don't like how small they are. I wish I had more flavor. Yeah, I could have a little I more I wish it flavor. was spicier. Yeah, it's really not spicy. Because it's hot chili. You know what? It's spicy because and tasty. Oh my I'm god, I'm looking at that bag. <laughs> <laughs> it's so spicy and tasty. Wait, does this <laughs> I think they're the same flavor now that I'm looking at them. <laughs> And this is um, six corn. Let's try them both and we'll rate them together. Mm -hmm. they're, they're literally by the same brand. The same creepy ass lady is there, so. <laughs> Moguls, you are getting at it, huh? Oh, oh my god. I'm a hot mess. <laughs> <laughs> I think these have more flavor. Yeah, these have more flavor. But it's the same flavor. I mean, I still wish they were spicier. They're very deceiving by saying spicy on the on the front. Mm -hmm. We have like no spice. <laughs> Moguls. Mowgli. Bro. I'd give those like a three. Because it's just like, why would I get those? I would never buy those again. There's no, like, there's no flavor to them. That's true. I'd give them probably like a three or a four. Because like, I would eat them. I just hate how, I would never buy them again because of how tiny they are. But also, I would never buy them because when I can buy these, and these have more of the seasoning on them than these tiny things do. Yeah. I would give these like a 7 or an 8. I said this one like a 4. Yeah. And then this, I would have to say 
like a nine since I buy them. Mm -hmm. So yep. these are the sweet and sour haichu. There is watermelon, lemon, and grapefruit. I want grapefruit. Okay. I think I'll do watermelon. <laughs> Everyone's honey haichu is very like it's chewy, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like it, but if you don't like chewy things, then... But, like, yeah. I do have to be in the mood for these because I used to get regular Haichu all the time, then I got kind of tired of them. Mm -hmm. So, this is my first time having Haichu in a while. But, I like the grapefruit, though. Are you still chewy? Yeah. Oh, shit. I'm I why, it. why I have issues. <laughs> it feels <laughs> weird to swallow. <laughs> than like the seafood crackers yeah it's a uh, they're kind of remind me of starburst without being so waxy which i kind of mm -hmm. like because starbursts are waxy to me yeah but yeah in terms of like that kind of like chewy fruit candy that's probably like some of the better ones i've had mm -hmm. or it's just the chewing stuff I'm not a fan of. i think i would give it like six and a half seven because i like them but I don't buy them all the time. Mm -hmm. I think mochi would be. I'm really. I just keep eyeing the mochi. <laughs> You're like, I just want a mochi. <laughs> They're so pretty, and I'm gonna pull them. Up. There's like jelly and like marshmallow or something. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, the mochi. Oh, mochi is a ten for me. Ten out of ten. It's. It is what it is. It's good. Yeah, you can't go wrong with it. Mm -hmm. I think. I'm really eyeing this sesame rice cake thing. Ooh. Oh, wow. <laughs> what the f*** is inside? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Here, I'll let you bite it's off It's not meat. It's not meat. Okay. Oh. Okay, because at first I thought that was tuna. And I was like, can you eat this? <laughs> but no, it's not. It's, it's fine. <laughs> I think it might be beans. Yeah. It's like, it's got like a mochi kind of consistency. It smells like a, kind of like those sesame balls. Ooh, yeah. I don't like it. I don't really like it. <laughs> <that much. laughs> There's like two textures. Yeah, I don't like the bean. The bean like stuck to the f <laughs> roof of my mouth. <laughs> mm. I don't like that. You want to spit it out? No, I'm a big texture person, but, and... Usually I love textures. I'm mm -hmm. like, yeah, it's so interesting. I hate it. <laughs> oh, I do not like the bean. Yeah, I don't either. It's weird. That's very strange. One out of ten. Yeah. <laughs> I guess one. Actually zero. I was going to say zero, but I was like, should I be nice? But I know there's a lot of people that love bean like that, but I just can't. Yeah. I can't do it. I would rather eat these. Yeah, I think I'd rather eat those too. Okay, you choose. Let's do the chocolate potato chips. Okay. I'll let you open these. They're in like such a unique packaging. I just like, little cup. Looks like a little ramen cup. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's what it looks like. Yeah. I'd mess with those. <laughs> it's like um. It's the same concept of when you dip like a fry in a milkshake. Mm -hmm. It's good. I would say I wish that like, I don't know how to describe it. Like the chip is crunchy, but I wish it was not as like airy. I could be an eight. I would actually wouldn't mind if they put a little bit more salt in it. Mm hmm. I think I'd give them an eight too. I kind of wish they came in like a chip bag though. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm thinking like, I'm so bad because I just want more. I, mean, I, I just want a big bag so I can save them. <laughs> oh! Do the lollipops. These are good. Yeah, that's what she said. And I think just don't like lick it. Like, just bite it. It's chocolate. <laughs> oh, not like that, though. <laughs> good chocolate. Have you ever had. I can't think of what they're called now. I think they're like Apollos or something. They're the Japanese candy and it's like strawberry and chocolate and they're like little. I don't know. I used to get them all the time, but it's the same chocolate. Oh. I feel kind of weird eating a girl's face. <laughs> <laughs> I know. 
It is a little strange. I give those 10 out of 10. That's just because I like chocolate and I've eaten those my whole life, damn near. Yeah, I give it a solid 9. Those are really good. Mm. I mean, it's just, it's, it's simple. Yeah, it's simple. Yeah, I, yeah, I would have given 10 out of 10, but the girl's face is really creepy. <laughs> that is true. The it's moment we milk bread before. time. I'm so excited. Oh, it smells good. 10 out of 10. I fucking love these. <laughs> yeah, I'd get this again. That had other flavors too. And it's like, and it's got little like layers. Yeah, I really like the layers. Yeah. Almost like a phyllo dough or something. Mm hmm. It's just like soft and light. Mm -hmm. Last <laughs> but certainly not least, the Puckies. Mm hmm. Oh, you picked the <laughs> knockoffs first. <laughs> now, in the store. I told Sierra of my controversial opinion. I don't like Oreos. And these are Oreo flavored. And they have, so, they are the knockoff, but it's like the cream is in the middle of the cookie. It looks like one of those, like, cereal straws. Yeah. Okay, you ready? <laughs> Maybe I hate more Oreos more than I thought. I'm so funny. Really? Too sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I, I feel like I'm being dramatic. She's like a birthday cake. <laughs> no. Oh my god, like, you're so right. I don't like things that are that sweet. This kind of stuff is like sugar on sugar on sugar. <laughs> and I mean, like, you do you. If you love that, you love that. But like, for me, it's a bit too much. So I'm bad. I do love that. <laughs> I love, I love all things birthday cake. Birthday cake Oreos. If you guys haven't had birthday cake Oreos, <laughs> Ash would really not like those. Yeah. But I think this is good. I give it a nine. Two. I just don't like it. <laughs> Coconut. Oh, these are cute. They're like, I've actually had these before, and I love them because I love coconut. Chocolate coconut. Yeah. Can't really wrong. It tastes just like, like an almond joy. Yeah. You got the almond. I give these 10. I just like coconut and chocolate, so. Um, I give these an 8. I really like them. Okay, so we can close our eyes, but personally, one of them's been calling out to me. Answer the call. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so these are the crunchy strawberry. Smells so good. That's pretty good, but I can barely taste the crunchy things. But it's good. Yeah, I like these. I can get these in nine. I like them better than coconut. Oh, uh, now I'm like, these are, I would give these a 10. Mm -hmm. Two. Because they're good. They're really good. I really want to eat the matcha ones. Yeah. I don't eat a lot of matcha. I, I, I drink matcha occasionally. I haven't in a while, but I went through a phase where I loved to get matcha lemonade. Not terrible. <laughs> I wouldn't say these were terrible. They're just a bit, um, I don't know. If you like the taste of matcha, I think you, you would like it, I would assume. Yeah. It's just not my favorite thing. Yeah, I would give it like five. Yeah, I'd give this a four. Yeah. I don't think I'd eat those and get them again. Not my favorite. <laughs> yeah, no one wants Pocky to taste like grass. <laughs> I know, it does taste like <laughs> grass. It's, it's not that good. Ooh, last but not least. I'm so excited for chocolate bananas. It's like... Chocolate banana banana cream covered chocolate biscuit sticks. Dang. Mm -mm. Oh, wow. <laughs> Oh, that's strong banana smell. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> I like these. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love this. I love chocolate banana. I would give those. I mean, personally, I'd give them a 9. I would give them a 10, but I don't know. I feel like with these, I taste like the more fake banana -y flavor than Chunky Monkey, but it does taste similar. But they're still really good. Don't get me wrong. So a nine for me. I give these a ten because <laughs> I love the fake banana flavor. <laughs> oh, you're back. <laughs> like you remember those? Um, I used to get them in like vending machines with like the toys and stuff. They used to have that like 
fruit candy that was like shaped like fruit. Yeah. And the banana one was always my favorite, and I'd oh, save it for last. That's so funny. See, as a kid, get out of here, both <laughs> As a kid, I didn't like like fake banana flavor, like banana and candy. But as I got older, I liked it more. Yeah, yeah. So this is very nostalgic. So ten out of ten for me. I freaking love it. Well, that was all the snacks. We hope you guys enjoyed this. Let us know in the comments what you think your favorite snack would have mm -hmm. been, or what would have been your least favorite snack. Mm-hmm. Now we're gonna go fight over who gets what. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Again, if you have any like other Japanese style snacks you want us to try, or maybe even a different part of the world, we'd super be open to trying that because this is a lot of fun and it's kind of cool to see what kind of flavors is like popular yeah. in other parts of the world. Yeah, but it is. It's always fun to try new things. So let us know what we should try next and where from. So please. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Mm -hmm. We appreciate you guys so much. Thanks for staying and hanging out with us while we try snacks. Mm -hmm. uh, we love you guys and we will see you guys next time. Bye! Mowgli! Mowgli, get out from under here! Stop it! What are you doing down here?